Hey guys, what's going on? It's my own better with a minute metal cables. Right. So look online. Remember you say about the you know, MacBook is breaking? No 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 the MacBook is fine. I think it's fine. Right, it's not, it's not broken. I think I looked at it. When, and I, I, I typed it in. And apparently one of my cables are fucking faulty. Now, which one though? Because I use HDMI to the TV. Fine. Turn it back off. HDMI. Unplug it. Right. I can see it flickering. I should have turned it off now. Yeah, next time I'm going to keep, keep it on, I'm not going to turn it off and turn it back on because I'm going to end up breaking the console. Alright, I'm going to do that and plug it back in. It should turn white in a minute. Any time now. There you go. So, so the trick is, um, if you're watching this and you, you follow this video on YouTube, you have the same problem with me where your Xbox is not turning on, don't worry, don't panic, don't panic. Unplug everything keep, and just keep that power supply in. It's your cables. So I'm just plug everything back in. I don't know which what it is though. I don't know if it's actually this here to mine. I mean, it's just a, a, like a pound. Alright, this is a pound shop cable, aka dollar cable, whatever you American want to call it. And no, I wasn't going to start on any one thing. Oh, you think the piece of American do already not? No, I was just looking at thing, you know? Because like, cause in the UK, we call it a pound shop, and the, the Americans call it a dollar store. Um, what else cables do I need to plug in? I plug in that one. I need the two HDMI back in. But, yeah, so obviously, guys, it's the HDMI or whatever it is. Just check it. Check it. Get rid of that. Just check all your cables, unplug it. And then it should go away. See, the Xbox is not broken. You know, do not have to go, oh no, oh, I've got paid for a new Xbox. Oh, I'm getting a new Xbox now. No, just don't. Just wait until it fully turns off and doesn't turn back on. But yeah, um, so that's plugged in, that's plugged in. Yeah, so obviously it, your cable, I don't know what it is. And it's not the power supply, that was obviously still turn, turned on when that's there. So it's either the HDMI's. What else did I have plugged in? <coughs> oh yeah, I had the, that in the back of all the hard drive. So yeah, I figured it out. So it's not broken. I can probably put it back over here, but I'm just going to leave it back over there anyway. Oh yeah, I've already plugged it back in because I moved it back over there. So yeah, now it's back over here now. Because you know how it was over there? Now it's back over here again. So it's obviously the one the HDMI's. I think it is that, this one for TV. So I might buy some like hardcore freaking um DMI is like from thick cables. Like I know these ones are thick, we can buy like proper professional ones, like PC World and stuff. So yeah. Gee man. <laughs> like, I, like I said yes, I've had the Xbox and the day, day launch, you know. Who wants to see some chocolate? You ready? You ready? You need, you need to see some chocolate? Oh I haven't got any. Oh, hey, got you two bum boys, exactly. <sighs> so I think that's it for today's video. And then Ron Bitter standing out. I don't know what will be the next video. Oh yeah, I did, I did get two little part, um, two thingies today, but I bought an official PSP. Um, just two and one cable. Focus. Yeah. So what it is, is, you see that yellow one for a PSP, and I've got like the PSP charger over there as well, the blue box. <coughs> that one doesn't work, the white box does. I bought that one from a packy shop, or whatever you want to call it, quite a little phone shop. It didn't, it didn't work after my time, but it even broke. And it also has the, the top part of the PSP, right there. I'm not bigger on top. So I'll be keeping that safe, just there. Now you also have to buy 
Um, my feet were killing it's unreal. Some more chocolate, you ready? Chocolate! Got you, sucker. Got my Game Boy there. This is real chocolate, you ready? One, two, three, chocolate! Got you. But now I'm buying analog, as you can see. I didn't realise how small these were. Hold on, let me take it off. And I've lost it. Just turn it on like fucking two seconds ago and I've lost it. Good day. Just lost it with the analog stick. Hello. No, look how tiny. Look how tiny that is. Like, if I just threw that across the room, where's it gone? But yeah. Where did that go? Oh, for fuck's sake, man. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> it's like finding a needle in the haystack. Uh, one sec, guys. Huh. A needle in the haystack. But yeah. I mean, it wasn't that annoying just to move that by that, that little thingy part, but yeah. There. There's the analog stick. You just push it in, and there you go. You hear it, it'll click, but yeah, there we go. Also, I've modded it. I'm just trying, I need a freaking download. I'll probably go on the other computer in there and download the game on there. My PC and see, oh, memory's too big. Oh, yeah, too small. Well, it's just see memory too big. You know, my life's too big. But yeah. I'm looking for you know, a part of Rack Room from PSP and then didn't find it. That game. Hold on. That game I'll keep just because Need to Speed's good. Them two I can't sell. That one's crack. That one's crack and that one's freaking scratch and get, whatever. I'll probably sell them on EV if really cheap. But yeah. I think that's about it. Nothing else to see. So, yeah. I'm doing a bit out of see you guys in the flip side. And I'm about to curse someone out. They, they, they know who they are. Are you ready? One, two, three. Hey boys, guess what?